Hi guys, I wanted to do a little update on the last two little newborn baby so beautifuls that I got. Um, I've been fixing their hair. And I did take photographs of the process in which I go through. Um, I kind of wanted to share that um, on a little uh, picture video since I wasn't able to actually go through every step um, video wise. Um, but then I also kind of just wanted to put everybody together and show you how they're coming along. Um, so hopefully I'll be able to put that video together before you see this. Hopefully. Um, you'll have already seen it or whatever. So these are the last two that I, I got. Um, and then the two on each side of them I got for Christmas. Um, they were gifted to me by Crystal. And now I wanted to... I wanted to do this video even though I haven't finished the other one, but I'm, I'm, I want to release the other one before I do this one, if that makes any sense, before I do more work on their hair, because I want to see you, well, I want to see you, <laughs> I want to show you how they look before I do another treatment on their hair, because theirs was really it wasn't bad. It was just really frizzy and coarse and it was, it stood up a lot. So if you look at the difference, his is still kind of sticking up. His looks so much smoother now. Look how smooth hers looks. And she still looks a little bit frizzy wise. So her hair is actually softer than her hair because this hair is very coarse on both of on both of them I don't know if that has to do with um, just whatever they used or I don't know but um yeah I wanted to show you before I do more work on her hair let me see if it'll show better See, it's kind of, kind of frizzy out there. Hers looks so much better in comparison. It's not all frizzy. So. You can see his, you can see his. His is still a little frizzy in the back. So. I'm going to be, um doing their extra their extra treatment because I only I only did one on them and I thought that was going to be good enough but it wasn't because her hair is still frizzy um pretty frizzy so um those two did come with names they had little names on their bracelets that one was Henry Hers was Hannah, but I changed her name to Henrietta because I thought that was cute. Henry and Henrietta. And I'm, I'd have to go check my book. I might have found names for them. But there's all of them. Look how cute they look together. <laughs> so those are my original set of twins. <laughs> Aren't they adorable? I should twin them back up. But they look adorable like that. Look at them. I'm gonna move them around. Hold on. They look so cute. Ah! Hold on. Okay, there they are. <laughs> look how cute they are. <laughs> I love all them. I want to put them on my shelf just like that. So cute. I want to try to make them some socks for their little feeties. Um... Yeah, I really do want to put together the, the picture because they had some little stains on their body when I removed their clothes. Just little things here and there. I was able to get them off. Um, I think there's like a smudge somewhere that I wasn't able to get off. Um, but uh, those... Okay, that is Blaine. That's Blair. That's Henry and Henrietta. 
and those two are, hold on, okay, those two are Bernard and Bernadette, so far that's their names, <laughs> but I also wanted to do, um, so I'll, I'll go ahead and show you kind of like a sneak peek, um, of kind of what I use to get their hair smooth and everything. I use a fabric softener. It really doesn't matter which fabric softener. Um, I just use what I have. And um, I think this might actually work better because I only did one treatment on their hair and I had a different fabric softener for their hair. So, this is Ultra, so maybe, maybe this one does work better, so maybe it does. <laughs> you want one treatment. <laughs> um, so, the other update is another baby's hair that I've been working on. My child of mine. And I did exactly half of her head. <laughs> so you see, this half is done. That half is still a mess. <laughs> but I wanted to show you the before and after right all in one. So here are her curls. All nice and done. And of course, like I said, I use the fabric softener. I just put a little bit at the root and some at the tip. And then I use the baby brush to comb through it. And you can see you have this frizz of a mess over here. I forgot to, no uh, to note, she actually has rooted hair. Her hair is rooted in her head. It's not a wig. Um, yeah, I just used the baby brush. Um, so as you can see, it's still all frizzy. I don't know if that makes it worse or better the flash okay it's still the sides still looks the same and then you've got this side that looks all pretty so that's how well this stuff works this hair is incredible though it's actually really soft so you know it's not it wasn't really bad it was weird though when I combed out one of the curls there was there was like a a shell of a bug. I was like, "Ew." <laughs> so it like nested in the curl. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh I don't know if I have a name for her. Hold on. Let me see. Okay, I didn't write it down. I thought I had thought of a name for her, but I didn't write it on my list. So, yeah, that's how I keep up with all the names. <laughs> I keep a list. <laughs> it's a pretty long list. Because <laughs> I like to name all the babies. <laughs> Even those babies. <laughs> so, yeah, her hair is looking awesome. I'd love to get some curlers to put a little more curl back into some of the pieces, but this hair is incredible. It's super soft. I love it. It's it's definitely the best doll hair I've ever seen. It's so soft. And I don't know what it is, but like I said, it's, it's not a wig. It's actually rooted in her head, which is really neat but yeah it's really soft and silky and it's so shiny I realized it's actually like a couple different tones of hair but um this hair kind of does what it wants so I need some curlers to kind of help put that curl back because some of it wants to curl, some of it doesn't. So, yeah, I just gotta play with it till it till it works. So I got one side done. 
And I'll get the other side done. It took some time, but it turned out beautiful, so I guess I'll, um, I'll work on her hair and work on her name. I feel like her, her face slouched a little bit more. She has fabric over her face. It's all soft, just like her, but she has like a plastic head under there. That's how the mild, my child dolls are. They have like plastic underneath this, um, soft fabric that kind of starts, uh, wrinkling over time. So and she's like, she's probably like 20 something years old. So <laughs> she has a few wrinkles. Okay. Give her a break. <laughs> but yeah, that's a little update, little, little trick. And, uh, look how that turns everything yellow. Every time I put blue in the screen. So weird. So weird. Oh, and I found her little red bow. Because everybody has to have... See, because my original little girl, she had a little red bow. So, I found her one. And I found her one. So, I'm slowly getting there their stuff together. His vest is pretty torn on the sides, which I did not know till I was undressing him. Um, so I'm going to try to see if I can fix it. I don't know if I'll be able to. I mean, it's hidden under his arms. I guess I'm pretty much the only one who knows, right? And now I showed you. But, um, I still want to try to fix it because I don't want it to completely fall apart. But they have thin wigs, so you will see his little his little head through his little his little wig. Um, but yeah, so that's Bernard and Bernadette. <laughs> To add to so I've got B's H's and B's what's what's BHB is that something I don't know didn't mean to that's just how it worked <laughs> okay guys um, I hope you enjoyed the little updates like I said I want to do another treatment on their hair but I wanted you to just see it compared to theirs before I did it so, thanks for watching, and thank you for subscribing. Got all the, the vintage babies. The crew, they're so cute. And I will see you guys later. Bye.